Hey what's up guys, it's Jake coming at you with another video. So today I'm going to show you 5 lighter tricks. I'm actually a little bit sick right now so hopefully my voice doesn't sound too bad, but um, bear with me. So these are just some cool tricks to do if you have a few disposable lighters lying around. Uh, in my case I bought a pack of like 50 for 12 bucks, so it's a pretty good deal. I'll put a link in the description if you guys want it. Alright, I need to say this, just a warning, uh, be very careful in doing these tricks. Remember, we are dealing with fire, so use good judgment. Alright, let's get right to it. Uh, for this first one, we're going to be making some cool exploding targets. You're going to need a balloon, a lighter of course, and a candle. So first take the lighter and rip the top off. So you're left with just a valve. Now unscrew the valve until you hear some fuel leaking out. Then screw it back in just a little bit. Now put the lighter inside the balloon and blow it up a small amount really don't need much air. Then tie it off. Now through the balloon, twist off the valve so the fuel starts leaking out slowly. Remember to pinch the lighter at the bottom through the balloon so the nozzle isn't touching the side. If it does touch the side, uh, when the butane fuel comes out, uh, because it comes out as a liquid, the balloon might pop because it'll freeze. So once all the gas is out and into the balloon, uh, it'll expand more and uh, you're ready to go. So, now just grab an airsoft gun or dart or something like that to pop the balloon. Now light the candle and place it right behind the balloon, not like too close so the flame pops it, but just close enough. Now when you shoot the balloon and it pops, the butane will catch on fire. And you now have an exploding target for very cheap. Alright, this next one is a classic, and you might have seen it before, but it's too good not to show you. Alright, so make a loose fist with your hand, so there's a little bit of air inside. Then hold the lighter up to it like this. Then press down on the gas for about 10 seconds, then light the lighter next to your hand. You now have a fireball in your hand. Pretty cool, right? Alright, so for this next one, we're going to need a bowl filled with some water, uh, some dish soap, and two lighters. Alright, first pour some dish soap into the bowl. Then break apart one of the lighters like we did in the first trick. Now unscrew the valve and put the lighter underwater so bubbles start forming. This is why it's important to use dish soap because they make the best bubbles. Now try picking up some of these bubbles and lighting it with the second lighter. You now have a way to make flaming hands that won't burn you. Unless you use something really stupid, but they shouldn't burn you. Alright, here's another popular one that everyone should know. It's the classic lighter hack. First, make sure the lighter is on full blast. Then pop off the heat shield and lift up on the fuel valve. Now push it over to the other side and pull it back down and bring it back over again. By cranking the fuel valve like this, when we put the heat shield back on and put it all back together and then light it, the flame is now massive. Alright, so for this last one, we're going to be making a mini flamethrower out of a bottle. Just grab a lighter and a plastic bottle. Hold the lighter's gas nozzle in the bottle for around 40 to 60 seconds. Then light the top of the bottle. When you squeeze, there should be a flame that comes out. Just remember to be extra careful when doing this. This flame can get pretty big and you don't want to burn yourself. Alright, well there's five of my best lighter tricks. Hope you guys liked them, and if you did, don't forget to leave a like. It really helps out my channel. Also, subscribe and check out my Facebook and Instagram to get notified when I upload more videos. Also, I'm still trying to figure out what I should do for my 50k video. So, uh, so far I'm thinking of a, maybe like a Q&A video and possibly like a face reveal because so many of you guys have been asking, it's like kind of ridiculous. Um, so yeah, if you have any ideas for that video, questions you might want answered, uh, leave them in the comments below. Alright, well, as always, thank you guys for watching, and we will see you in the next one.